the gleam of new chrome, the sparkle of new paint, and that wonderful perfume that only comes from a new car. Yes, it's a familiar scene, one that's played every day all over America. And we're all better off because of it. You see, that beautiful new car and the way Jim Johnson feels about it are the symbols of a constant desire for something newer and better that is typical of all the Johnson families across the nation. And the competitive drive to satisfy that desire, to build that better mousetrap, is the force that has made the American marketplace the most abundant in the world. We in the automobile industry know the story. We helped write it. Front end and grill finalized. Trim combinations, colors, and fabrics presented. The best of them chosen. A long look into the future with but a single objective. Leadership in car styling, in car performance, in car ownership. And always better tomorrow on the American road. You don't put together a magnificent machine like this overnight. You don't plan and style and design and tool and build an automotive vehicle in a matter of months. But planning a new vehicle is not simply dreaming up something that looks like a rocket on wheels and then manufacturing it. Lines and forms and contours, both functional and pleasing to the eye, where the difference between success and failure is the customer's reaction to the car or truck or tractor we have produced. A decision will be made, a direction taken. Changes will be made, certainly. Suggestions offered. But for all practical purposes, here will be decided what the car or truck or tractor of three years from now will be. And that's why the Ford rides softer by far. 